Hello. Today we're learning about Chapter 5, Lesson 1, Repeated Addition, which is multiplication for Chapter 5, Lesson 1. Now, let's read what the story is telling us. Alex bought four bags of apples. Do we see that? Yes! Now, each bag has seven apples. Well, let's see. Let's count them. We see one, two, three, four, and three more makes seven. 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 Okay, so I'm going to put seven here. Now, four and three more makes seven. seven. Seven apples, you're right. Now, four and three more. Seven. Good job, guys. Nice. Now, here again, four and three more. Seven. Now, so we see, what do we see here in these bags of apples? Four yes, groups. Christopher? We do have four groups, you're right. Now, do they all have the same amount? Yes. Yes? yes. Does everybody agree? They're yes. all the same? Yes. They're all the same. They're equal amounts. Now, first we see and we're like, well, what's the question? There are mm, apples in all. What is that? What do you think that's trying to tell us to do? Yes, Christopher. How much apples there are? How many apples there are? All of them. The whole thing. Do you guys agree? Yes. Okay. Yes. So, how could we do that? What operation would help us? Share really quick with your friend and whisper the answer. Really quick. Just whisper. It's a silent whisper. Kind of like secret whisper, you know? Not really silent, but secret. Okay, so Pablo, what did your friend tell you, Pablo? Pablo, what did your friend tell you? What operation do we need to do? Ashley, help him out. We need to add we need to, to add us missing. We need to add oh, Pablo, just all of a sudden he remembered. So you mean we need, need to, to add? add the part. Okay, so we can add. Tell me what numbers I need to add. Four. Tell me what to write. Four. 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 I can write four. Four plus, plus seven. Plus seven? seven? It's going to tell me all the apples? No, no four times seven. Four times uh, seven. So, you mean I have four groups? Four. And seven. Each one has seven. 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 Okay, that's true. And you need to add them. You need to. I need to add them. Okay, well, what do I need to add, Ashley? Tell me. You need to add the four groups that have past seven How do apples. I write it? Tell me how to write that down. Four. Four times seven. Yeah, but you're telling me to add. You're not Four telling me to multiply. Seven. I can't multiply. But how do I do add? What what numbers do I add? Uh -huh. Seven and four. But seven and four gives me what? Eleven. How do you know it's eleven? Because seven, because seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, you count it on. Yeah, but does yeah. that tell me I have eleven apples? No. Does that make sense? No. We need to count oh, we you know what? Let me count. ask. Let me ask Leslie. Leslie, what do you think I should do? Yeah, you need to add four, I mean seven plus seven. Okay, seven plus seven, and then what else? Plus I add seven plus seven. Fourteen. Fourteen. Plus seven. Plus seven. Now, somebody, somebody's yelling 14. Also, why are you yelling 14? Why? What's your thinking? You're not confused. Why is it for, why do you think 14? Tell me. You're not. I'm telling you. Where did you get 14 from? Let's get two. Where did you get 14 from? I said 14. Oh, did he? Okay, so Pablo, why did you say 14? Because two sevens make 14. You mean these two sevens give me 14? Mm -hmm. And what would these two sevens 14. give me? 14. And then you need to add the both. And then I need to add these two? Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, well, do you guys agree with them? Yes! yes. Now, so four ones plus four more ones gives me how much? 28! No, no, no. Listen to the question. Four ones plus four ones gives me eight, eight ones. Eight, eight. Now, one eight. ten plus another one ten. Twenty-eight. Gives me how many tens? Twenty-eight. No, 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 no. I want you to listen. Just look at the question. One ten 
plus one more ten gives me how many tens? Two. Two, two what? Two tens. Two tens. Now, how many apples do we have in all? Twenty-eight. Twenty-eight apples. I said the now, answer. So four groups of seven is equal to how much? Twenty-eight. 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 It's gonna okay. be easy peasy. It that was, was easy peasy. But. Guys, did we have to think about what do we know? No. Yes. What is this showing me? Was it showing me 7 plus 4 or 4 plus 7? No. no. It was not. And we figured that that, that wasn't it's what they were asking and that wasn't what was in the picture. What was in that illustration? Okay. Now, for homework, I want you to show me all this work plus one more thing. What was the whole amount of apples? What was the whole amount of apples? Four. What was the whole uh, amount of apples? Uh, uh, Emmanuel, what's the whole amount of apples? 28. 28, yes. What was it? Yes, that's the whole amount of apples. How many parts do I have? Four. Four. So I can have four parts. Do you guys agree? Yes. How much is in each part? How much seven, in each part? Seven. So I can have seven here, seven five. there, seven there, and seven there. So we know that we have four parts. Each one has seven inside, and the whole's 28. So I'm going to write this down because, Emmanuel, I like to label. This is my whole. This is my number of parts. And we can also call it groups. I have four groups. I have four parts. Same thing. And how much in each? This is inside each group. Each Inside part. each part. Inside. You guys see that? So it's very important the multiplication that first you have the number of groups or the number of parts, how much inside, and it'll give us the whole. Do you guys agree? Yes. Who gets this? Thumbs up. Show me. Thumbs up. Awesome, guys. Awesome. So I'm going to see awesome homework.